America's top law enforcement officers stepping up the war on synthetic drugs. Derek Schmidt joining 42 other attorneys general, urging gas station owners to stop selling them. New at 6, Cake Step Ferris explains why the warning is coming out now. Deb. Well, Susan, the National Association of Attorneys General researched and found hundreds of cases where stores were caught selling those drugs to teens and young adults. One after another, police and other law enforcement agencies are making arrests at gas stations and convenience stores across the country. The stores are caught selling synthetic drugs. Now the top law cops in the country are cracking down. This letter sent to nine of the biggest petroleum companies in the world is signed by 43 attorneys general, including Kansas Attorney General Derek Schmidt. The letter states that there have been more than 130 gas stations caught selling those synthetic drugs in 29 different states. It cites over the last several years the number of teens under the age of 17 going to the emergency room after taking the drugs has more than doubled. Wichita doctor Amy Siri has seen the spike and is very concerned. We've seen heart injuries where there's damage to the actual heart tissue or sometimes the electrical conduction system. So their heart goes into what we call an arrhythmia and those can be life threatening. She says the sell of the drug is one problem. Getting the message to kids and their parents is the second before it's too late. Who knows the purity of what they're getting? Who knows if the dose they took last time is the same as the dose they're taking this time? And that's why this is such a horrible gamble to take with your life. The AGs are even asking petroleum companies to revoke their relationship with any station that sells any kind of synthetic drug.